What's up everybody? Welcome to Ori Oration. I'm Greg and while you were watching that Macklemore dance all over the freaking Grammys, the fine folks at Nabisco were making endless variations to Milk's favorite cookies. So every Wednesday and Friday I tear open a new package and give you a tasty review without any calories. If you like that, like the video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to us here on YouTube. Today, we're reviewing cookie dough Oreos. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, they are limited edition. Yes, I have here your, your millions of tweets, your cries, they have been heard. It is time to finally see what these up. Of course, a beautiful package. And let's not lie, this is the most mind-blowing announcement you could imagine, right? An Oreo cookie with cookie dough in between. This is how you know we're in the end times. It's never gonna get better than this. But also, I like that they put here, made with chocolatey chips. Oreo's always very good about not putting themselves in a corner, right? They always say flavored cream, and they spell cream different. It's not real cream. And then chocolatey chips. Is that a chocolate chip? Who knows? We'll find out. All right, so every oration begins with the patented first look. Mm, I mean, I wanna love these. Let's not lie. Get out of your cup. But you notice already, we have a few busted Oreos, not bad, but then this big old missing space here, the smash cookie up there. What happened there? Why are you doing this? But let me tell you, the bouquet, it's got me. I'm pretty excited about these cookies, like I've been saying. All right, so first look, it's good. You know, I mean, as far as what we've seen here on the oration, we've been doing this show a long time. I'm saying it's one of the better, better looking first looks, but let's get into, of course, taste. That's what it all comes down to. That's the one we've been waiting for. It's going to require some research. I mean, the first thing that hits me right is just that it's sweet. It's very sweet. I'm not, it's not it doesn't taste like cookie dough. Let's not lie. It's not, you know, you, you, everyone knows cookies are great. Sure. But cookie dough is where it's at. You, you know, the, your mom puts raw eggs in it. She's like, it will kill you. And you're like, I don't care. I will eat this by the handful. And that's how you lose your little sister. But this one, I want to let it breathe. It's really sweet. I'm, I'm losing the cookie doughness of it. I'm not real, it's not speaking to me saying cookie dough, because obviously, again, we want it to be the two parts of the Oreo and your mom's cookie dough in the middle. She's a sweet one. I, can, I definitely taste the chocolatey chips, whatever the hell that means. But it doesn't taste like cookie dough. I'm gonna do. I'm going back in for more. I'm crazy tonight. I like it. I would eat this cookie in a recreational fashion, not just in my profession. But again, not very cookie doughy. Now I'm just getting some of the cream. Yeah, I like it, but I don't know. Let's see how it pairs with milk. Of course, this is a big part of the cookie dough. Oreo's test is how it's gonna fare with a little bit of milk. Get the nice zoom going here, all right? We're gonna do the McElroy moment. One, two, three. It pairs well. It pairs well. Like a fine steak with a glass of wine, if I ate steak and wine a lot. I'm getting more hints. There's a, there's a definitely a, a new flavor, texture, smell coming out of this cookie now. Again, I don't think it tastes like cookie dough. But the milk brings out a texture in it that was missing before. I'm gonna, again, go back. Again, I like these cookies. I like these cookies a lot. <gasps> They're really good. Period. End of statement. All right. Like I don't, I can't give you the full rundown of it tasting like cookie dough, which we're all expecting. I got to get over that, I guess. We're going to twist test. One, two, three. Perfect twist. No remnants. Let's see. Of course, we do best two out of three here on the oration. Boom. Another perfect one. 
I'm, let's see if I can taste the cream a bit more like that. You go like that. You say, yeah, you fat little man. What do you think of that? I like him. I want to, I want to suggest double stuffing these guys. I mean, even single stuffed. That's how God intended them. That's why the God in Misco made them that way. But again, there it is on the back of the tongue. It's almost like a Starbucks cappuccino kind of flavor, right? That's not cookie dough, but that's that kind of chocolatey taste you're getting. Not cookie dough, but something you'd get out of a coffee flavor or a chocolate flavored coffee drink. Good job, Greg. It's a good analogy. I'm sure this guy agrees with me too. So final score for the cookie dough Oreo. Too sweet as a double stuffed, great twists, great taste as a single stuffed, I want to dock it for the double stuff, but I'm not going to. 9.0, an amazing cookie, totally down with this limited edition. Go out to your store and get it. I know it's brand new. A lot of people don't have it just yet. It is coming to everywhere as limited time to offer. I like them quite a bit. So that's the way the cookie crumbles for cookie dough Oreos. But what do you think? When you get them in your neck of the woods, let me know in the comments if you agree with my review. Then make sure you keep coming back to this channel every Wednesday and Friday. Most of the time, we post a new review of an Oreo cookie for you. You get to see if they're good or bad, and then you go spend your money. Everyone's happy. You don't even get fat eating bad cookies. Only I do, because that's the life I chose for some reason. <laughs> oh, oh, ladies and gentlemen, like I said, every Wednesday and Friday, a new Oreo review. Until then, like the video, share it with your friends, subscribe to us on YouTube, then go eat some cookies, and keep on dunking. <laughs>